please. Hey, we just want to go see the wrestling wall. Can we do that? Yeah, you know. Can, where, how do you where, know how you to know where it's at? Yeah, you go on straight aside parking anywhere and at the uh, roundabout, that's where it is. Okay, the, thank you, buddy. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hey, guys, we're here. This is John, the Wrestling Talk in the Shop, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are in uh, Tampa, Florida for the Royal Rumble, and we thought we would ride by and see. They got a little wrestling wall in the old armory here in Tampa. Let's show them to go in there. We're on, it's a small little setup. It's you, I seen it on dark side of the ring. We're gonna go in and check it out. Follow along as we go this way. Thanks. Wrestling at the armory. Here, I'll let you read it. You come over here. Yeah. Giant and Swans did battle here. Larger than life in size and personality, good guys like Eddie Graham and Dusty Rhodes sought to vanquish evil doers such as Boris Malenko and Dory Funk inside the wrestling ring. Every Tuesday night for over four decades, this building, then known as Fort Homer W. Hesterly Armory, transformed into an arena for championship wrestling from Florida. And in those years before the Bucks, Rays, Rowdies, and Lightning Bolts bought, brought Tampa crowds to their feet Professional wrestling was the biggest draw in the city. With no air conditioning, even in the heat, uh, the heart of Florida summers, the heat was excruciating in the building. The thick, lingering smoke from cigarettes and cigars when puffing away indoors was allowed, made it even more difficult to breathe. But no matter, nothing could keep the fans away. They booed, they cheered, they stood on their feet as emotions rose and fell with every punch, kick, and slam. On Tuesday nights, this was the Madison Square Garden of the South. This was the home of the Titans of Tampa and will always be the house that Florida Championship from, rest, from Wrestling from Florida built. Ready for him slowly? Terry Funk and Dory Funk. Harley Race keeps punched in the corner. Young Harley Race there. Black Jack Mulligan. The Briscoe Brothers. Dusty Rose and Kingston. Here's a picture of what it looked like with the ring set up. There's some cards. Yeah. And there's 80 gram at the Tampa Sportatorium. We did a video on that. Our channel too. If you'd like to see it, we were visited it. Bonnie Watson. Great Moolah and Sherry. And here's a just a small thing of it. There's the gym there. Yeah, they really got it done up nice here. Thanks for watching. And here's what it looks like now. You can see it's a very big building. I bet it was a cool wrestling facility back in the day. Yeah. There's military vehicles and whatnot. If you, visit, if you want to visit you visit it yourself they're really friendly and they'll let you do it i think to do the place you got to have like a membership or whatnot let's see if we can get a shot get a shot of what what all is there but anywhere i go i like to try to get a taste of the wrestling history they should do something like that in Dallas for the sportatorium we had but here we are thanks for watching guys